Welcome back to Cursed Mining and today it is time for another mining farm update. We do these on the first video day which is now Wednesday of every month and talk through all the machines or what is upcoming with the channel. Let's say except when life is too crazy that's why I left out September. More on that later. This month's update is a bit of a funny situation in terms of mining because it's basically Ethereum and Monero. Everything I got GPU wise no matter if new or old is on ETH right now. As you saw in my DeFi videos I just love to put my mined earnings to work. ETH mining is going well and at the same time we have many rumors and uncertainties about new GPUs both already released in Nvidia and on AMD's side. Many of you already got their 3080 and 3090s here in Europe though. It always takes longer to get new tech. I'll keep my eyes open. But I'm also very curious about big Navi. If that wasn't the case, I'd go for more of normal Navi and pump everything full of 5700s. I'm very happy with the RX 5700 and its efficiency. But I still have older cards to get rid of. Or I'm thinking of just letting them mine until they die. I'm not sure yet. Part of me wants to continue to upgrade. Part of me wants to wait for new cards. So what are you guys doing? Are you still adding on? For the situation now, I think my lowest weakest card I have is a RX 460 on the AMD side. Up to 580s and RX 5700 on Nvidia. I still have a few 1060s. I also just never got the time to flip. 1070 Ti, 1080 and most efficient here is the 1660 Super. Here too, I'm thinking of finally selling my Pascal cards and looking for more efficient workhorses. I'm still CPU mining too of course and doing my say few cents a day on Monero. There is the 3900X, 1700X and every GPU mining rig CPU as well when possible. There were people asking about a CPU mining video and how to optimize more for random X than the one video I already did. Now that I'm back, let me know if you would be interested in a video like that. My ASICs are still off, there is nothing worth for me to run right now. Even though yet again the X13 algorithm would make a few cents per day if you have cheap electricity. Besides that I am finally home. <laughs> So if you have not followed the channel, basically I was on the road for the last two months. The first one was planned, the second one was say more spontaneous. I have to say without crypto this would not have been possible. So I want to bring content in those fields too. Actually living with crypto and how to use it. More upcoming videos in that regard too. For now though still a lot to process on my end. Other than that I really want to move some older equipment as well and do more projects. Of course you'll see everything of it on the channel as well. Stuff and parts have been piling up a bit. Long story short, mostly Ethereum and Monero mining here, consolidating my equipment. In my other crypto adventures it's looking similar at the moment. Markets are wild reacting to the world and I'm rather rebalancing what I have than being too risky. Also, we just surpassed 5000 subscribers and I wanted to thank you very very much for that. I'm planning a giveaway for that too and of course I will release it in video form. That's already it for a fast update. Thank you very much for tuning in. I'm really grateful for every one of you who is on board. No matter if hardcore miner or casual crypto nerd, please subscribe for weekly tech and mining content. I wish all the best to you folks. Please be well. Happy mining and bye. Thank you.